So today we're gonna make a chicken pot pie, but instead of that traditional thick crust that chicken pot pie is, we're gonna make uh, our crust out of phyllo dough. So this is what it looks like in the store. And um, it's not that thick puff pastry, but this phyllo dough, and when you take a look at these, these are super thin. And we've also prepped a little bit by um, cutting apart some of our chicken. We got some carrots, we got some potatoes, we got some garlic. Eat this. Yeah, go ahead. And then we've got some peas. I like to add peas. So now our butter is nice and melted. And now we're going to start um, painting. I got this round dish, which is perfect um, for at least a family of four. If you need to do something bigger, that's fine too. So Sunny, why don't you do a, a coat of butter first on the dish? So go ahead and do a nice coat here. Good job. And let's get the edges really well too. All right. And we're gonna do one more sheet. So we had three, four, five. We're gonna do six on the bottom. Is that nice and buttery, Sunny? Mm, yep. So usually you have enough of uh, the phyllo pastry sheets to not only do your pot pie, but also do a dessert at the end. So we'll show you how to do that. All right, so we're gonna put that last layer in. I don't think you need more butter because you went a little bit butter happy on me, which is fine. We like butter in this family. And at this point, all we're gonna do is, do you wanna help me add some chicken? Yep, put it in there. So we'll do a layer, of, big layer of chicken here. You wanna do the carrots. All right, throw those carrots in. Great, pick them up. Okay, well that worked. That did a good job. Um, we're gonna put the potatoes in too. Go ahead and put some potatoes in, Sunny. All right, it's easier if you actually pick it up and put it in there, there you go. Um, and then we have to peel our garlics. We got a couple of these garlic spoons. So we're gonna put some of the um, chicken juices in there as well. And we're also gonna add um, peas and these peas are really good. I don't know why, but we can eat these right out of the can, right? You want a bite? Oh, I want to eat these out of the pan. I know you can't eat them all, but there you go. So we're gonna shake some peas in there too? No, okay, go ahead, but don't do all of it, okay? Just about half. If you don't like peas, just don't add peas. My mom doesn't really like peas. So when we make it with her, we just oh, add some peas. more. I know you love peas. We add some more carrots and stuff and more potatoes. I so that's, that's perfect. And then we're gonna kind of cover up this pot, pot pie. Um, with our sheets here and and then we're gonna put some fresh pieces on top okay so it looks pretty so here's one I'm gonna put a little bit of butter on that one Sunny Bunny mm -hmm. go ahead and usually a stick of butter is good for not only the pot pie but for dessert as well there you go uh oh it's broken I know. So we're going to take these pieces off the edge. We'll, we can have those later. Okay, Sunny Bunny? Why? And then, here we go. Want to butter that up again, Sunny Bunny? Brush that on. There you go. Looking good. A little bit all over the edge, right? Nope, over here. Get some more butter on all, all up on the edge, all over the place. So that's the second one. Let's do a third one. Is that, is that one or two? We have to break them in PC member. Yep, take those off. I can't tell if this is one or two. This is really thin stuff. So this is what we make our baklava out of too. Maybe that's just one. All right, let's put that back on there. Break the edges off. There you go. And I know Sunny's gonna sneak some of that after we pop it in the oven. So let's do at least one more. So this is four. Actually, we're gonna do five. Is, mm. that, is that butter yummy? Yeah. We always use um, salted butter. Not everyone does, but we always do. Yeah, it's super good tasting. No, I'm good. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Here we go, and I'm gonna um, kind of oh, tuck peas. it in there. I love peas. And we used about, um, mm. so there was most of the chicken left. Um, we probably used mm. uh, about I would say a third of what was left. So we're gonna have a lot for soup and we could have filled this up with a little bit more Yum. chicken. All right. This is pretty good. These are good for you. Yeah, they are good for you. Peas are so yummy, especially those sweet peas. They make right? your veggies strong. That's true. It's always good to eat your vegetables, right? These are vegetables. All right, so once again, that oven was heated to 325. Eyes done, so we're gonna stick this in the oven. And since everything in here is basically already cooked from last night, um, 
it's not going to take very long to cook. So once that top gets golden brown, it'll be ready, and that takes about 30 minutes. So while so. our pot pie is in the oven baking, we're going to make dessert, and we're going to use this rest of this phyllo pastry um, to make some little puff pastry cups. So first thing we're going to do, we're going to we're going to make three because there's three of us. Why don't you um, coat three of these little things? Um, with some butter, okay? Not too much, just a little bit, okay? So it doesn't stick. Go ahead, all around and everywhere. Perfect. So this is a um, popover pan, but you can obviously use a muffin pan. Go ahead and put it in the cup. You gotta kinda be careful so it doesn't break apart. Why? Because it easily breaks apart in there because they're so thin. There you go, that's a good job. And then we're gonna put a little bit of butter in each one. So you probably need like a third of a banana in each mm -hmm. one, right? And pop it in there. Can I do these two of them? Sure. So our mm -hmm. pot pie is done. It's nice and golden brown, as you can see. And when we eat that, we are going to bake our little desserts. There's that one and this one. And we're gonna put these in for like 20, well, about 15 to 20 minutes. Okay. So here's our pot pie, if you want to take a look here, um, and we're going to show you what the inside looks like. And I'm just yawning for, like, yawning, yummy. Mm -hmm. Okay, and here is your chicken pot pie. It's nice and warm and yummy. So if you lift mm -hmm. this up, you're going to see what it looks like in there. Super hot, and this crust, if you want to listen, super crunchy. So hope you enjoy this recipe, and um, we're gonna sit down and eat, and I'll show you what those desserts look like when those are done as well, right? All right, this is what it looks like. You can serve it like this. Um, pretty yummy with, with some vanilla ice cream, but it's actually really good just by itself, too. Yeah. What do you think? Do you think it looks cute? Pretty cute, like a muffin, it's like a muffin. It is like a muffin, but with bananas and yumminess on the inside. Yeah, it's like a banana. Banana muffin. It's like a banana muffin. Enjoy, guys. Have a great day. Have a sweet dreams.